Good morning everyone. Now before I get started on today's video, I've got to correct an error in the Go 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 Sport V Pro video that I made. I didn't quite direct you to the right place for the big Black Friday discount. What you've got to do is to go to the company website and there'll be links below. And when you place your order, there's an opportunity, there's a box that you can put in the discount code and uh, and away you go and I, do you know what? I'm getting so old I can't remember stuff I should have this written down I believe the Black Friday offer is 20% off which isn't bad at all tell you how forgetful I am I'm not even certain I got my underwear on uh, the right way around this morning doesn't feel right you know what I mean anyway today's video when I started playing golf in 88 wooden woods were still a really big thing and then there was metal woods which I I bought those I didn't use wooden woods and they were all the same 125 cc head tiny little thing 41 and a half inch heavy steel shaft and every single manufacturer seemed to have access to the same pot of silver grey paint and the head covers were boring as well boring colours and they really weren't any better than the wooden woods that they were replacing but in 92 I hope this traffic noise isn't too loud for you in 92 somebody brought out a 60% larger driver 200 cc's 43 inch graphite lightweight shaft bright colors I bought it and it was called the monster as soon as I got this off eBay it cost me seven quid I recognize all the writing down here I also recognized this is the original grip from 1992 now this model's 11 degrees, the one I had was 10. I don't think it's going to make any difference. But let's go and see how good this old, kind of like, part of the evolution of golf drivers is. Well, I haven't practiced with this thing, and I wish I had because it's going to take me a few goes to get the tee height right and that has only gone 200 with it being like a wedge Not about as far as behind me. well that first drive went nowhere left me 167 into the green which is unacceptable but I used to draw this club so uh, I need to tee it down and close the face a bit and hit that draw that I used to now let's go make me bogey. Okay, tee it down, aim right, try and hit that draw. Well, that's only about a yard off the ground. And that hasn't gone very far either. Well, I'm glad I got the camera wrong because you won't be able to see the impact. But it's not pretty. <laughs> it's bloody awful. I'll tell you what guys, someone, someone mentioned recently you shouldn't call everybody guys, you should just uh, treat it as if you're talking to one person. So mate, whatever your name is, the one person I'm talking to, nostalgia isn't all it's cracked up to be. At 175 into the second, part of the third. Got to shut up, someone's playing. Yeah, I'm, I'm on the right fairway. He isn't. I don't know how far that last drive went. Nowhere. I'm struggling with it. The T height and everything. 
Gonna give it a couple more goes though, just for old time's sake. But I've, I've hit a five wood into the fourth green today. And the five wood went further than the driver. Hard to imagine that this club was the dog's bollocks in 1992. Ah oh well, I think this will be the last time I come out with any old clubs. Well finally, a decent one. I get this out, 210 yards, which isn't bad uphill really. And then young Ben, who isn't even 16 yet, he said let me have a go. And he, um, he knocked it 30 yards past me. Yeah, it, it might be the Indian, not the arrow. Did you see young Ben hit that old driver of mine? Handicap index 1.4. And he's not 16 yet. Yeah. I think this, uh, this club's probably going to end up in the bin. I'll give it one last chance though on the 8th. Cheerio. I might just be getting the hang of this now. I reckon with a bit of practice, I might actually start hitting it properly. That one wasn't bad at all, apart from being very short. You know, thinking back, I used to get this driver out there about 225 in the summer, so I'm not doing too badly. But that was a bit of a stinker. Well, I thought being 11 degrees, I might have actually got that ball. I got it fat though. The golf swing's a bit rubbish. Let me see, I, I think I was a 16 handicap when I owned this club. And if I think I, uh, can't even get my words out. If I keep using it, I'll be back to a 16 handicap. So, uh, it's going in the trash. Cheerio. Oh, nostalgia. Ain't, help, ain't what it's cracked up to be, is it? Well, as this is the last hole, I was going to bang my usual music on it. But I think you need to hear Ben. That's my reputation as a it is driver. Very sure. fine fairways. Yeah. 